Senator, why did you write? Why did you vote yes, Senator? Tell us why Senator. you changed your mind. Senator. Senator Clay, but why did why did you vote yes? I understand that you said just on last Monday. Night, I stood that the, that the in witness front of your office. office. On Monday, I stood in front of your office with Annie Barkin. I told the story of my sexual assault. I told it because I recognized in Dr. Ford's story that she's telling the truth. What you are doing is allowing someone who actually violated a woman to sit in the Supreme Court. This is not tolerable. You have children in your family. Think about them. I have two children. I cannot imagine that for the next 50 years, they will have to have someone in the Supreme Court who has been accused of violating a young girl. What are you doing, sir? I was this sexually assaulted and nobody and believed me. I didn't tell anyone, and you're telling all women Sorry. that they don't matter, that they should just stay quiet because if they tell you what happened to them, you're going to ignore them. That's what happened to me, and that's what you're telling all women in America, that they don't matter, they should just keep it to themselves because Sorry. if they have told the truth, they're just gonna help that man to power anyway. That's what you're telling all of these women. That's what you're telling me right now. Look at me when I'm talking to you. You're telling me that my assault doesn't matter, that what happened to me doesn't matter, and that you're gonna let people who do these things into power. That's what you're telling me when you vote for him. Don't look away from me. Look at me and tell me that it doesn't matter what happened to me, that you'll let people like that go into the highest court of the land and tell everyone what they can do to their bodies. Do you have an answer, Senator? Senator Clay, do you think that Brett Kavanaugh is telling the truth? Do you think that he's able to hold the pain of this country and repair it? That is the work of justice. The way that justice works is you recognize harm, you take responsibility for it, and then you begin to repair it. You're allowing someone who is unwilling to take responsibility for his own actions, and willing to hold the harm that he has done to one woman, actually three women, and, and, and repair it. You are allowing someone who is unwilling Senator, to take responsibility for his own actions to, to sit Senator. in the higher court of the country and to, and to have the role of repairing the harm that has been done in this country to many people. No, no, thank you. What do you think? You have the power. No, I want to talk to him. Don't have to respond. What do you think? To respond. I understand, but tell me I'm standing right here in front of you. What do you have? Do you think that he's telling the truth? Thank you. Do, no. Do you think that he's telling the truth to the country? You. you have power when so many women are powerless. Thank you. Even Thank you. Can you not well, give them an answer, Senator? We have our press room. You, you just released a press statement. You don't have Please. the courage to give them an answer? Okay. Thank you. Please. Thank you. Please. You just released a press statement. You don't have the courage to give them an answer? Thank you. Thank you is not an answer, Senator. Thank you. Saying thank you is not an answer. This is about the future of our country, sir. You're you can be a hero today. To a lifetime appointment in the Supreme Court. That's fine. Find security. Be a hero. Senator, you can be a hero and why not? Why, why not wait? Why not wait? Why not wait for the investigation? There's no harm. How can you be speechless? We demand to know what you're thinking. Do you stand with women? Do you stand with this nation who deserves due process? Senator, do you want to respond to their complaints? Senator, do you care to respond to their complaints? No, I, I need to go to the hearing. I just issued a statement. So you can send an email. You can't give an answer? No, I, I, We're asking you for an answer. There have been a lot of questions here. Do these yeah, women not I deserve an answer? answer? You've heard a lot of this. Everybody There's only one question. question. Do you I have asked why? Why are now? It says that they should wait for an FBI investigation. Everyone deserves an answer? They can be heard by the highest people in power. 